So doctors say that this year a flu shot is more important than ever to reduce the number of flu related hospitalizations during the pandemic. And that includes making sure your children are vaccinated so they don't infect more vulnerable members of their family. Free vaccinations are currently available. An organization called Health Hero is offering them and Jeff Lott is the president of the Florida office. Good morning. Thanks for being with us. Thank you, Jen. I'm glad to be here. So, you know, the reality is you just can't walk into any pharmacy and get your child vaccinated against the flu. Would you explain how Health Hero is really helping to fill that void? Absolutely. And thanks for having us. So uh, having opportunity at vaccinations for uh, pediatrics or young students and kids is awfully difficult uh, in and around the city. Uh, great options are pediatricians and the Department of Health. But what we've done is we've decided to create an organization that's been out now for the last nine years, and we're in 14 states that really will provide vaccinations inside the schools. It's a school-located program. So we provide at no cost to the families the opportunity to get a flu vaccine. So then are you, I know that, that schools are, are obviously, um, you know, being very cautious uh, given the pandemic. So no problem then for you to bring your personnel in and offering these so the kids can literally be taken just out of class, assuming mom or dad is okay with it and get that free vaccine? That is correct. This is an opt-in program. We partner with the school districts and in doing so, we notify the parents of our nurses and our team coming into the school. Parents opt in with a parent consent form and with their permission, we would vaccinate each and every one of their students. And this they, is a no cost program, Jen. Yeah, and, and I think that that's a very important point to make also is that it does not cost anything. Are there any qualifications or requirements of that child? Uh, other than uh, age uh, range uh, from pre-K to 12 and uh, not have any uh, pre-conditions uh, pre, um, uh, conditions that would prevent them from doing it. We screen that. Uh, in advance. And, you know, we've heard this year they're now offering the flu mist. Is that an option for these students or is it only the injectable? This year it's only the injectables uh, is the option right now. So, I, I, you know, I still hear from parents to this day, and I'm always surprised by it, they, they think that their child will get sick if they are vaccinated. How do you respond to that suggestion? Oh, well, it's been proven that that is not the case. This is not a live uh, virus. Uh, this is, is um, the quadrivalent, and so that is not an option at this point in time. And, and a reminder also, if you would, uh, and, and we we've, we've have our own campaign here through the city of Jacksonville, why it is so important this year uh, to make sure as many people in our household are vaccinated as possible? Well, for the obvious reasons, right, for respiratory issues, uh, flu being the, uh, the primary, we also know we're dealing with the COVID pandemic. So when we address both of these issues uh, right up front, we can start to eliminate at least the flu from this. Uh, so the other is, as what happens to healthcare in the hospitals, uh, if in fact we have overrun with both conditions. So I was looking through on your website. It looks like Nassau County and Clay County um, school districts are, are partnering with Health Hero uh, to offer this opportunity for local children. And I want to point that out to our viewers, uh, given the fact that we have many uh, school districts and, and parents who are watching us from many different districts. I is there some kind of paperwork that they should have seen in their kid's backpack that came home? Or should they contact the school if they didn't see anything as to when these vaccinations would be available? Yes, uh, this is a, a welcome, welcome program and a partnership with the school district. So what we'd ask is them to get in touch with their local school districts. And in doing so, we would then come into the school and then provide those uh, immunizations. Perfect. Jeff Lott, thank you for your time this morning. Do appreciate it. It's an important message for as many people um, who, who are watching this morning, certainly to hear, uh, given the fact that we do not want to overwhelm our hospitals by having more, uh, more admitted as a result of the flu. Thank Absolutely. you for your time. Thank you, Jen. And I do, as I pointed out, Health Hero has clinics in Clay and Nassau County. And by that, I mean the availability of children within those school districts and receiving these free vaccinations. For a list of, the, of um, those that are participating, you can search online by going to healthheroflorida.com.